Why do you have to beat up? Mike Tyson? Look, this is just a huge misunderstanding. Go off. Look, man, I'm warning you, I... Asento! 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 Howdy, partner. Welcome to hell. I'm coming for you. Damn, Phil, you took your whole shit. Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson is here. So? I'm literally Satan. F- fair point. I'll, uh, I'll just leave. No, next time. <laughs> you want me to, uh... No, no, I don't want to. Are you gonna fight him? Blood and give him the satisfaction. Blood and give him the satisfaction. The best way to torture him is to ignore him. Is to ignore is to ignore him. Remarkable idea, sire. No, if you'll excuse me, I'll be going about my day. Breathe in. And out. Um, excuse me, Satan? Yes, teacher. Um, yes, uh, who's your little friend there? Well, don't worry, he's not really my friend. Yes, well, do you have a guest membership for not really my friend? No. Then, unfortunately, you two must leave. It's completely fine. <laughs> Ryan, please. I trust that this handsome, young customer knows what he's talking about. Oh my! And I thought only bees pour on the honey. What? Can you get your friend to shut up? I've been trying to ignore you. Wait, aren't you my yoga instructor? I'm still not gonna fight you. You look stunning tonight, kitten. Kitten. Huh? Oh, thanks, Pookie. I know we've only been on a few dates, but I'm starting to think you're my certified lover boy. Who are you texting? Nobody important, Sugar Plum. Really? Then let me see your phone. It's giving trust issues. Give it. Are you now? All right, now let's see who Mr. Not Important is. Two ones of our... It's 21. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought he's not important. Pookie, that's not what... Wait. You're breaking up with me? I'm sorry, Butterbear. It's not you. It's just... Yeah, no, it's you. Oh, that's my stuckums. Two to lose, Sadie Wadey. At least I have these collectible Uggs to remember you by. Oh my fuck, you were fighting! Oh, he's nothing out of your ass. Don't you mean our ass, partner? I kinda like it. Yeah, it was hot as hell. Alright, Mike, to make this fair, I turned off my invincibility. You should keep it on. That's <laughs> if you. Ow! If you keep doing that, I'm gonna punch back. I warned you. Mike, 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 you took a pretty hard punch, but that couldn't have been enough to take you out. So why are you on the ground? No answer. Fine. I'll tell you. You want to lose. Why? Isn't it obvious? Who lives in fear of your own violence? Afraid you'll never be able to control it. Letting loose a vengeful demon spawned by a violent upbringing. And there's a part of you that doesn't want that. Part of you that thinks if you beat Satan, you'll live the rest of your life in a blind, uncontrolled rage. But I need you to understand that if you lose, you die here a demon. But if you stop trying to control the anger and instead accept it as a part of you, you can beat Satan and thus your own demons. What do I do? Use your fist. But don't use them to destroy. Use them to build a better future. Our time is up, so stop holding back and show them the true strength of fire. Oh, did we wake up the princess? Don't worry. You're gonna go back to sleep again. Real soon! Real soon! I'm sorry, did I, did I say princess? Yeah.